is Doc. He is a 12 year old 14-3 black gilding. This guy is a been there, done that, all over kind of horse. There's that kind eye shot for you. This guy is as gentle as he can be. Good for any level of rider, unless you're just terrified. Again, I, I always hesitate to call them kid broke bomb proof. But this guy is as gentle as they come and as broke as they come. And we're going to let Stiffy crawl up on him. And walk him over to the obstacle course. Chickens also going off in the background. Here we have got Doc on the obstacle board. Dr. Feelgood. We just call him Doc. Now that wind is blowing and those flags are going crazy. same truck and boat. I, oh no, I'm sorry, that's a truck and logs. That is truly just getting lucky, guys. We don't plan that one. And now for the entertainment portion. husband rode him last weekend, my nephew rode him last weekend for spring break. Just jump on him and go. We'll see him in the creek. Here we are going down to the creek. There's smoke and mirrors and we'll have to say hi. Doc is paying no attention. I wouldn't say he's like a rainy horse, but the horse is fine. He'll stand all day if that's what you want to do. Walk all day if that's what you want to do. I can't say he could gait all day. This is not your endurance horse. This is not the horse that's going to do 20, 30 miles a day. He's the horse that you can depend on to get on and always do the same horse. I wouldn't say lazy, but not far from it.
Oh, good boy. Pretty one, too. There's Doc out on the trail heading to the second creek. Half the time, Sebby hasn't even had her feet in the stirrups. The other half, she's flinging her legs around. This guy doesn't care about much of anything. We had a lady come look at him last weekend, and she said, he's just not enough horse. <laughs> so if you need a confidence builder, a beginner horse, or just one to enjoy, you like to mainly walk, and do some gating every once in a while, and you don't want any... BS or any drama, this is a good horse for anybody at any age. He <laughs> built for feed, not speed. That is very true about Doc. Very nice. Picked his feet. Pick this placement to make sure he didn't stumble. Only real reason we added this creek, but around here we've got some really sketchy areas. We've got Southern Illinois, and we've also got Mammoth Cave, and lots of big rocks and terrain that it's easy for them to stumble on. So you need to see how they're going to do on that. Take you back to the barn and see what else the has got in mind. All right, let's do the broke spooky test. Steffi's going to ride him back to the barn backwards. Woohoo! Nice ground tie there right by the barn. He's a whole jungle gym of fun. whole jungle gym of fun. Alright, we're going to get him picking up some feet. Stop giving feet. I think I mentioned this. This guy is also super, super sweet. He absolutely loves attention. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he is ground tied right now in front of the barn. Nobody's standing in front of him. Nobody holding him. Yes. He says, I am a very good boy. A very good boy. And a very pretty boy. Like that long, long, pretty mane. So that is Doc.